Paralog, Tea Field Village. Suggested base class level 4. DNA donation level 3. I have those. Begin chapter. Paralog, budding talent. It's gonna give us like some new These character. These pills ought to clear up the problem. Let me know if the pain persists, okay? And you're looking chipper today. I told you that cold would be gone before you know it. Father, isn't it time you took a break? Look, I made you some tea. Thank you, John. You didn't burn yourself or anything. John and John. It, I hope. You worry too much. I'm old enough to manage a simple pot of tea, I assure you. <laughs> it makes me happy to see you growing up so fine. Huh? What's going on out there? Manigans? You have to help us. Monsters are on the attack and people are getting hurt. Oh no, monsters. They're roaring at us. What the devil are those beasts? <laughs> this will get ugly. Sharp, go and hide. I'll take care of bringing people to the clinic. This way, everyone. If you're unhurt, then assist someone who is injured. Must pull together. I know father told me to hide, but how can I? I have to do my part, too. Mm, go fight the, the monsters. Oh, no. Green units. <laughs> la, 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 to you, too. Get moving. There's shelter at the clinic. Keep your wits about you, everyone. I'll patch you up once the crisis has passed. We can't stand idle with the corrupted on the loose. Let's save those villagers. Okay. Are you all right? Get to safety and leave the corrupted to us. You don't have to tell me twice. But there's still a few left who didn't make it out in time. We'll do everything in our power to save as many of them as we can. They'll love you for it if you do. You're their last hope at this point. Okay. So I, I can't bring everyone. All right, let's start. There are so many wounded we couldn't get to the clinic. Is it up to me to treat them all? Father, I'm here to help. If we split Father. up, we can treat everyone. John, I thought I told you to run and hide. I can't stay hidden away when there are so many who need my help. After all, father, am I not your son? You taught me that a doctor does whatever is needed. My lessons have sunk in, I see. Very well, then. Come and give me a hand. Okay, talking. We see a conversation icon on a unit. Move to the adjacent position and select talk. Practically seeking, speaking with such units is a great way to recruit more allies. So basically, I can go recruit John. What about Sean? Sometimes these units will only speak to specific people. So let's assume like Alir. Can recruit him. Out the enemy. Here goes. Okay, I'm gonna have you visit. Don't know how much you still get out of this, but every little bit helps, right? Defense tonic. I don't want that. This isn't so bad. Yeah, okay, go ahead and sit right there. We'll let these people come attack you. Let's go! If we engage on her, where can she zoom off to? I could go all the way up here and kill this mage. Actually she could zoom all the way up here and help these people. She can just zoom at all sorts of places. Yeah, let's just go ahead and zoom over here and uh, beat this guy up. Give him a nice slim lance. Bam. Ow. There is nothing to fear. <laughs> and she can sit right there. She, okay, so confirmation, she is still flying. 
while engaged, even though she doesn't have her Pegasus anymore. Okay, so what does this guy got going on? They want to come attack Alir. Their 22 physical attack. To my, like, 6 defense. Me? Okay. Wait, what if we, uh, if we chain guard? Let's try chain guarding. Yeah! The divine dragon looked right at me. Okay. I will do what I must. Move over here, like so. Use that slim sword equipped. Miss Bam. Bow guy does no damage. The uh, uh, chain attack does, but oh no, not the civilians. Ah. Uh. Guess Chloe will have to help them out. Can also warp blast them, dude. Oh, you missed. Nice. So I don't even have to lose any health on Fram. Okay, so they're gonna heal these people. Good, good. Double this guy. I can just one shot him with Riders Bane. Hey, goodbye. Bam. If this love is a crime. Hey, bond three. Momentum. Attack plus one to the first attack during combat for each space unit move before attacking. Sandy stuff. I don't really want that axe person to attack her. <laughs> Let's just let the, let the civilian take the hit. Okay, just wait right there. That's good. Yeah, get him, Fram. Punch, punch. That's how it's done. Yeah, 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 she killed someone. Level up. Magic and speed. Alright. All these people now. Uh, I can't reach with you, unfortunately. Yeah, no doubling. Okay, so you can't kill. You can kill. Okay. Get rid of them. Bam! <laughs> Level up. Dex and speed. Speed is good. Go ahead and get rid of you. Fireball! I will not forget your loss. Take that pole axe. That guy can come attack me from over there? Sure. Okay, before I do this, how much damage can I do with her? She'll probably be fine. Yeah, she does plenty. Go ahead and iron lance him. Help. Okay, then we can finish him. 
her. Iron bow. Pew pew. Out of the tree. I'll have to up my weights. Level seven. Just HP and Dex. That's not a great level up. Okay. Uh, sure. You just come up over here. Oh. Let's see that zero damage. Dink dink. Okay, heal him up. Oh, heal me too? Oh, thanks. I can't reach him with anyone, I don't think, besides uh, Chloe. I could warp blast him. Okay, well, you can't kill him. Neither can you. Okay. Neither can you, but he's the only one you can attack. So come up, give him a fireball. And I'll finish him with, uh... Guess you. Hmm. I'm a little worried about this mage here. Could always have her zoom down here and kill that mage. Oh, all right. Matters Bane. So real quick, does she benefit from? Woods? No, it doesn't show a bonus. No, okay. Just double checking that. Anyways. Attack. Rider's Bane. One shot him. Bam. Goodbye. There is nothing to fear. Oh, almost level up. Back slope. Who's that that's down there? That's that guy that I'm going to be killing. Let's go right here. Sax dude wants to attack her, that's fine. Could obstruct. <laughs> no, I don't think we need to be doing that. This guy, the boss, is bow corrupted up here. What do you guys got for items? Was oh, that a bullion? Thousand gold, essentially. I guess we don't get bullion items. We just get gold straight up. Okay, how do I want to deal with this situation? I suppose you should just kill this guy. Because I don't think I want you to fight the mage. So your tail ends. Okay, you can reach the mage. But then she can't. She doesn't kill him. Hmm. Okay, you can't do anything. Just go right there. Alir. Just come stand right here. Iron Bow, he hits back for 13, which is kind of scary. Um, I'll only do 5 to her. Well, yeah, she can engage and use Seraphim. Die. <laughs> Allow your soul the rest it deserves. Because Archer can attack her. Oh well. Let's have you come... Yeah, right here. That's a good spot. Okay, 
do nine damage. That's fine. And then we blast him. Oh. I want to help you. Yeah, he's going for her. Ooh, good miss. Mess him up. Magic. Speed is good though. Okay, that Pegasus Knight is a threat. Needs to be dealt with. So you come up here, get rid of this guy. This time, victory was mine. Ooh, bond nine. Avoid plus twenty. Okay, let's see here. You cannot reach the Pegasus Knight. Nope. What do you do against the Pegasus Knight? I can double with that. I do not double with that. Double the Slim Lance. Does 19 damage total. Let's see. Uh, that's probably what I'm going to do. Okay, go ahead and you move up here. Uh, let's have you heal. Heal her. Oh. Okay, good stuff. Keep moving this way. Warp. Warp, warp, warp. There's a void spot right here. So we could warp, blast you. Or blast you. I could kill this guy. He's not as much of a threat as this guy. So let's go ahead and blast you. Ha! My apologies. Bond six. Magic proficiency. Alright, let's finish him off. Ah! Bye. You were beautiful while you lasted. That's gold, very nice. it right there. Let's move right there. Oh, I'm fairly leader. Ow. Oh, thank you. In these useful green units. Okay, now we can go ahead and talk to you. It's not safe here. You should be running. I can't. I'm the local doctor's son. I won't leave until I've helped the injured. You've got a lot of heart for your kid your age. All right. Let's join forces and save those villagers. I really yeah. appreciate the help. My name's John. Now come on. There's work to do. John joined your group. So we recruited this kid, <laughs> but not his dad, so uh, I guess we're just going to be taking him. Sounds perfect. She's also a you know, martial monk chi adept that can punch and heal. Don't really have much use for him. I mean, he joins at level 1, and I already have Fram. So let's see. Next dude over here. Doesn't kill. Okay, well, I'm just gonna take a turn to bait him out. And then this guy. I guess we'll just uh, blast him for some XP. Yeah. 
Looking for the divine dragon. Let's crit there. Okay, come over here. Wait. Seven. Late. Okay, yeah. I'll give the kill to you. Thousand gold, very nice. Um, yeah, might as well have you just uh, grab this. Get a nice refill. She already did her warp. There, uh, go sit in this bush. <laughs> well, that guy's moving. Oh, this guy didn't attack. I guess he's beelining for the, uh, the building. Hmm. That's unfortunate. I don't think she could reach with Engage, could she? Oh, she can reach him with the Javelin. Okay. Just Engage and zip on down here. And, uh, Javelin this dude. Where do you think you're going? Why would she have like a follow-up at half damage? Okay, then you can head back up this way. Oh, maybe that... Oh, she just doubled him. But the first attack did 20 because... Momentum. Right, 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 right. Okay, Fram. Punch him. Bam! Don't mess with the steward. Okay, I'll have you head over here. We'll get to this building soon. Talk to anyone now. Okay, go ahead and move up. Move up. Here, you can do a heal. There you go, XP. Okay, he went down. That's good for me. You can come over here, get a refill. Let's go visit the house. Thank you for checking in on me. Do you think you could use this? There's not much I can do with it, at any rate. Better it should go to a soldier like yourself. Was it a weapon? Oh, an energy drop, okay. Is it a nice strength booster? Um, I guess at this point we can just kill the boss. Let's not do it with Chloe, though. I think she's my highest level because she's just been murdering everything. Let's move these people up. Yeah, yeah, rah, rah. No. Ow. Not supposed to hit me. How rude. Here until the end. Like I don't kill him. Let's see 
here. You can come over here and get a heal. Some XP. I guess we'll just warp down here and blast him. Yeah. Get some XP. Engage. Emblem engage. And then Lord Star Rush. Now we just have a 100% hit chance. Four times nine, please. Just yeah. poke the heck out of him. Has and we're done. That's lovely death scream. All the monsters are gone. We're saved, mm -hmm. and it's thanks to the lot of you. Took all the XP. I'm glad no one got hurt. I was a little worried there. You can't know what this means to us. We decided to give you this to show our thanks. Was it lots of money? Oh, a surge. Oh, get a free surge. Pure water. Chloe and Sigurd MVP. Come now, Jean. Give the nice people a proper thank you. Was that his late? Is that lady his mom? Oh, right. Thank you for saving our village. We saved it together. You did well today, Jean. Oh, I introduced myself to you, but I never asked your name, did I? I don't have a name. Don't worry well, about it. There was a lot going on. I'm the Divine Dragon. The Divine Dragon? From the land of Lethos? Oh, please forgive my rudeness. <laughs> Don't mention it. Like I said, there was a lot going on at the time. What brings such a splendid personage to our humble village? I had a mission here. I've been on a journey to defeat the Fell Dragon and bring peace to the world. The whole world? Wow. If it's all right with you, Divine One, can I come along and help? Well, you want to save the world? <gasps> John, what's gotten into you? <laughs> My dream has always been to become a doctor so I can save people. And that hasn't changed. But with monsters running rampant, I might die before I can do that. Look what just happened. At the Divine Dragon's side, I think I can learn to fight and to heal people at the same time. Well, oh, that's all very well for you. But what about the Divine Dragon? You'd just be a burden. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Not if what he did during that battle is anything to go by. If Sean wants to come, I don't mind. Though, I understand why you'd be worried. Well, if he has your permission, then... I can only ask that you take good care of my boy. What? You're actually allowing him to go? Father, I told you, you don't need to worry about me. It's not like I'm never coming home. Or is it? In fact, when I do return, I'll be a first-rate doctor. You'll see. How quickly they grow up. Of course, Sean. Be a good boy, a hard worker, and an attentive student. And come home safe. I will. Thank you, both of you. I can't wait to start working alongside the Divine Dragon. The feeling is mutual, Jean. I have a hunch that I'll be leaning on you a lot in the days to come. Chicken. Adopt the chicken. <laughs> Arise, chicken. Arise to Somnir. That's support. Okay, that supports Clan and Louie. And how fare you today, Prince Alfred? Thank you ever so much for inviting me. No, that's too stiff. I should try to sound warmer. Is something amiss, Clan? Uh, where did you come from? My apologies. I thought I heard someone mention my prince's name. Hmm. You heard right. Prince Alfred invited me to work out with him today, but I've never spent time alone with him before, so I'm nervous about saying the wrong thing. 
A private exercise session for the two of you. That's right. Hmm. Not a solo or a group session. What could this signify? I don't think it signifies anything. Ah, but pay me no mind. So then you are practicing your greetings to the prince? Yes. I don't want to embarrass myself by being accidentally rude. Maybe you could be my sounding board. Yeah, just go up to him and say hi. Let's fight. I'll talk to you like your Prince Alfred, and if anything seems off, you can correct it. A capital idea. When it comes to manners, you have turned to the right man. I feel like this is gonna go poorly. Oh, that was it? Aw. So, Etienne and Boucheron. Are you ready yet, Boucheron? Hmm? Ready for what? Ready to tell me what you're mixing into your food to get those muscles. <laughs> not this again. I've told you before that it's got nothing to do with my diet. That's what you say, yes. But today, I'm going to get the truth. But that is the truth. Muscles come naturally to me. That's the long and the short of it. Still sticking to that story, huh? Because I should tell you up front that I've been watching you, Boucheron. You have? And? And I know you don't do anything but fish or read all day after training each morning. There I am, working up a sweat, while you sit under a tree with a book or a pole. There's no way you can do that and still stay in such incredible shape. So I assume that whatever you're doing on the slide really works. All right, listen. Wait, are you using magic? <laughs> Unbelievable. The lengths you'll go just for some muscles. No, it's nothing like that. In fact, it's nothing at all. I'm done arguing with you about this. People shouldn't see the prince's retainers quarreling. Good day, Etienne. Right. That's just what he'd say if he was hiding something. She's on to him. The jig is up. Say lean in, Louis. Is the tea to your liking, Princess Aileen? Very much so. I particularly enjoy the aroma. I smell a hint of citrus, along with floral notes, yes? More than one variety, if I'm not mistaken. It brings to mind the blossoms often found during the warmer months. Taken all together, the scent is most pleasing. I endeavor to satisfy. This black tea is a mix of leaves from Southern Firenay with dried fruit rinds and flowers. It's heavenly, as the blends you prepare always are. The chance to sip the tea you brew is one of the small joys that gets me through each day. <laughs> You're too kind, Princess Saline. Somewhat related, do you remember the special leaves I mentioned recently? Yes, of course. You said that they would produce a unique and distinctive flavor, if I recall. You recall correctly. I have a lead on how one might acquire such leaves. I take it that would interest you. Truly? You're right. I'd love to sample it for myself. Excellent. The wait will be worth it. Okay. They be drinking tea. Alright. Chapter 6. Mountain Settlement. We regained Faring Castle. The party heads to a shrine housing the Ring of the Dawn Maiden. Begin chapter. Chapter 6, The Stolen Ring. Someone take my ring. Almost there. Just a little farther north and we'll be at the shrine. The landscape's gotten rockier. We're near Brodia. It's all mountains up there. I'm seeing fewer villages as well. Makes this a good place to hide an emblem ring, I suppose. Yeah. The closer you are to the Brodian border, the colder and quieter it gets. Look. Not a soul in sight. You're right. There's no one around. Hello? Except her. Oh. Now look. Another character Take with lots of hair. Around. Wait for it. I wonder what she's doing here. <laughs> she's crying. Oh, well, doesn't that break the heart? I don't I know. Is she help. evil? I am her prince, after all. I won't stand by when my people are suffering. What if she's evil? Uh, Alfred, wait! <laughs> Oh, what a scrape I'm in. Hey there. <gasps> What's the matter? 
Something I can help with? <laughs> Why you got a star on your face Sa and in your hair? <laughs> Sa? I knew we'd startle you. Sorry for popping up out of nowhere and... Lizzy! You came just in time! I'm saved! What? Uh... I lost something earlier and there was nobody around to help, so I got real stressed out. Oh, right. I skipped over the niceties. You can call me Yunaka. Hiya, papaya! Yunaka, hiya, papaya. Hiya, okay. papaya? Huh. I've never heard that one before. Anyway, what did you lose, Yunaka? It's a little round ring. Kind of shiny with a hole in the middle. Oh, a ring, you say? Oh, and it talks, for some reason. Oh, a talking ring. Definitely sus. Come again? Yeah, I figured you wouldn't believe me. I believe you. It might be an emblem ring. Please, go on. What did it say? Hmm. Well, if I remember right, it asked me to take it to the Divine Dragon. Oh, well, that's good. To me? Is that... Did you... Uh, are you saying you're the Divine Dragon? Maybe. Yes, I am. I'm sorry I didn't mention it sooner. I'm the Divine Dragon. And now that we're doing introductions, I'm Alfred, the Prince of Firinae. Holy broccoli! <laughs> Why didn't you lead with that? I, I think I just had a heart attack. Nope, false alarm. Phew. I'm so sorry. I never meant to impact your health. Yunaka, how did you find the ring? I was walking along the border, minding my own business, when I heard a woman's voice. Help me. I'm right here. I'm by your foot. <laughs> huh. You're quite the performer. Anyway, I picked up the ring and she said, Take me to the Divine Dragon. But at that point, I had no idea where the Divine Dragon was, so I told her I couldn't help. Interesting. She knew the way, though. Told me to start heading for the capital of Firinae. Huh, that's good advice. The quickest way to get to Lethos is through the capital. But on the way, I was attacked by bandits and ran off full speed. And now the ring's gone. I must have dropped it somewhere. Woe is me. Sniffle, sniffle. <laughs> Surely just said sniffle, sniffle. But now that you're here, you're going to help me find it. Right? Right? After hearing her story, this definitely sounds like an emblem ring. Probably the ring of the Dawn Maiden. But that means someone took it from the shrine. Or it could be another emblem ring. We'll just have to find it and see for ourselves. Oh, wouldn't that be convenient? All right, Yunaka. We'll help you. Golly, that's great news. She'll be so happy if you're the one who finds her. Let's start by retracing your steps. No sign of the ring so far. Maybe somebody got to it before we did. Yeah, everyone's combing the area. If it was lying around, we would have found it by now. You're sure you didn't lose it before the bandits attacked? I had it on me when I passed through that ghost town over there. Huh? What is it? <laughs> it looks like the town's overrun with bandits. XP? Let's what? go. How can you tell? I'll bet these are the same chumps who ambushed me earlier. Let's take a closer look. They've taken over the town. These are the bandits I ran into earlier. No doubt about it. And that means one of them's got... Aha! Right there. Well, how you could you see, see that? Yeah, a burly guy with something glinting in his hand. That's gotta be our missing ring. What if it's just a piece of gold? What do you think, Divine One? You found a Is penny on the ground. Hmm. He's too far. I really can't say. You must have great eyesight, Yunaka. Yeah, I have a killer's eyes. Uh... It's kind of a cool line. What was that? <laughs> killer eyes! I've got killer eyes! You know, they're great at seeing stuff. If you ever need something looked at real good, I'm your gal! <laughs> so, like, is she a thief? Anyway, what's the plan now? I don't think we've got we have two problems yet. that need solving. A stolen ring and a town full of bandits. The ring's our first priority, but we can't leave them unchecked. We'll only attract attention if we all charge in at once. I say we split up. You know, send in a small group to recover the ring. Nice and stealthy. All right. 
Okay then. Come on, Divine One. You're with me. Ah, this is the Fog of War map. If we go through here, I bet we can sneak up on that guy with the ring. Slipping through a side passage. Smart thinking, Yunaka. Yeah. Victory is defeat Taranda. Guessing that's the enemy boss. It's pitch black out here. How can we fight them if we can't even see them? Don't worry, Divine One. That's what I'm here for. You're not gonna join the group with their killer oh, eyes. So sharp, I can spot baddies even when it's dark or foggy. Oh, so this... you get your hands on a torch at least. Then you'll see as well as I can. So she just innately has good vision. In dark places, only the areas around allies, beacons, and torches are visible. See with caution, enemies may be lurking in the darkness. The darkness. There he is! Let's take him by surprise. Good idea. Please, take me to the Divine Dragon. <laughs> this looks pretty pricey. Oh, is that the guy with the ring? So net me a nice lump of gold. The boss doesn't need to know about it. <laughs> oh dear. You can't even hear me, can you? <laughs> I hear her! That's the voice from before! That's definitely an emblem ring. Yunaka, will you help me get it back? Of course, you weirdo! That's why we're here! Right. Well, thank you. Now that I hear her, your impression was incredibly accurate. <laughs> Stop! You're gonna make me blush! Is that the boss? Deronda? So we got this dude. She's here at level 6. So that's effect poison. Some classes like these use knives that inflict poison when they hit. Poison enemies take extra damage. Repeated knife attacks will increase the potency of the poison. Ooh. Interesting. Units remain poisoned until the end of battle, or until cured with antitoxin or restore staff. Interesting information. Uh, so we can just mess this guy up. What Let's all got? attack with her first. Just to, uh... Oh, he's got a hand axe? Why do you have a hand axe? That's rude. I can fight. Okay, I'm just gonna kill you. Die. <laughs> so where did you come from? From the bushes. No! Break, extra attack, and finish him. Unnecessary crit. But my treasure. It's mine now. Bond XP between Elir and Marth is at max. Select Bond in the reference menu on the Somnial World map to be spawned level further. Okay. We got the ring! Heal us! Emblem of Dawn! Yay, Dawn Ring! Is it Micaiah? Blinding white light. Micaiah! I am Emblem Micaiah. I sense the future shifting. Now victory lies ahead. That voice is weird. Ah, so it is the Ring of the Dawn Maiden. Yunaka, I entrust this ring to you. Me? Uh, but I... She oh, belongs with you. All I ask is that in return, you help us defeat these bandits. Will you join with Emblem Micaiah? Yeah, okay. I won't let you down! Yunaka, let me show you how to use staves. Emblem Micaiah specializes in healing magic. With the Sync Skill Cleric, a unit can use staves regardless of class. That's cool. The Engage Weapon Shine attack Engage Weapon Shine attacks and illuminates the area when used. Okay. The Engage Skill Augment increases Staff Range and Area of Effect. Grant Staff Range plus 5 and Area of Effect plus 1. 
So you can use staves at range. And they have an AoE? That seems crazy. Engage attack, great sacrifice, fully restores the HP of all allies at the cost of reducing the user's HP to one. It's pretty thematic to Micaiah, she had the ability to heal people at the cost of her own HP. Do I want her to move all the way up there? Engage. With my magic, you may illuminate even the darkest of places. <laughs> Look at it changes her hair. She looks so weird and totally changes her hair color. She can't really do anything right now though, so let's just hold off on that. I live to serve. You can light this. Okay. There's a sword, dude. Okay, attack with the steel lance. Bam. That was a mage right there. Hello. there. You're gonna stroll up here. Finish him off. Bam. This is what I trained for. Oh, you got a torch. Cool, cool. Do you need to deal with these people though? How am I gonna do that? Sure. Let's go ahead and stand right here. Let me at it. I am ready to serve. Your steward's ready. Let's hear it. Oh, you can chain guard. There we go. For peace. Okay, that leaves her. Sure, let's do it. Oh, hello. Looks like we got us some uninvited guests. Snuff the lights, you lot. You got it. Let me turn that one off. Oh, they're turning off some of the other lights. Ow. Thundered me. Oh, there's a bow dude down here with a long bow. Jeez, that could have been bad if he could have attacked, uh. Chloe. Not oh, the axe guy came in with a hammer. I didn't even know he had a hammer. <laughs> Good thing he didn't try to lure him with Louie. He put out that torch. Looks like our cover's blown. They're snuffing the torches. Don't sweat it. We can relight them as we go. Okay, beacon, flood beacon. Next to it, we light uncover hidden enemies by illuminating darkened areas. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, you don't have a hammer, I don't gotta worry about that. Uh, let's have you come down here and poke this guy. You don't want that longbow. Hold off. Let's see. Felix for the kill. Very good. That was tense. And now he gets the hammer. Hmm. And just the vulnerary. Sure. He's just loaded up on weapons. damage can you do? 11? Okay. So I have to use the steel bow. 
leave him with 11 HP. Okay, now Clan can finish you. Bye. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, come up here and light this. Okay, let's see. Slim Lance, kill the mage. Goodbye. I'm sorry. It's a good bomb for. Hit plus 15, cool, cool. There's a wall right here. Yeah, so he, that axe user can't come down to hit her here. So, why don't we sit right here? Um, Is it my turn? Javelin 411, do it. Get rid of you. You were a good fight. I'll take that longbow. Uh, just, just this vulnerary for now. I want to hold on to that so I can trade it over to a TA when I have a chance. Okay, now heal him. These two to move. Could probably warp strike up by here. Just blast this dude. Gauging doesn't really help. Can attack him with shine though. So what I'll do is we'll attack you. Should I engage and shine him? Okay. Let's do this and see how this works. Kind of like lit up a big area around him. Is it like a shine orb? Okay. Now you die. Bam. Very good. I warp up here and blast this dude. Goodbye. Get nuked. Allow your soul the rest it deserves. Okay, on seven for them. Number six, two. Cool, cool. <laughs> yeah, nice try. And now you die. Ooh, level up. Excellent. Speed and luck. Well, speed's nice. Oh, there's a dude over here. Good miss. Excellent. Saline level. Magic and speed. Very good. Oh, she got a point of build? I didn't, think, I didn't even know you could get that as a level up. What the heck?
right, who has the bow? Him? Yeah, he has the bow. Probably no one up here, right? Hello, anyone over here? Oh. Is there someone in those bushes there? That would be bad. Okay, uh, move up. Iron Lance poke. Steel Lance could kill. Should we go for it? 83 chance? Let's just do it. Very good. That was eye opening. I don't think you opened your eyes, did you? I'm ready. Okay, and then you can come up here and give her the longbow. Bam. Alright. So that has a range of three. Yes. Okay. Okay, move up. Move up. Fire blast this dude. Get him out of here. I want to help you. Oh, this just hits like everyone. Everyone, everyone. Mend her from range. There you go. Get some XP. Okay, we got these three. Uh, you can just move up to here. You can move up. I'm kind of scared to move these two forward because they could be vulnerable. forward. Here, what if we use this? Which XP? Okay, we can see a dagger dude up there. Alright. This is fine. Oh, she gets poisoned. Punch you. Let's see. Um, so I think it's here and you can go through. Might as well have him continue this way. So it looks like there's an opening down here to go through. him some punching. Bam. Bam. Level up. Magic speed, resistance. Cool, cool. Okay, now let's finish him off with uh, Alfred. Seems good. Iron Lance. Bam. Get 
Did you reach with the heel? You're right here. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. No, not great sacrifice. Jeez. Heal her. Okay, you need to get down here. You I can't see anyone. Just go light the torch. Can I light it and then move again? Oh, she can't light it because it's. Are you kidding me? Okay, wait right here. Looks like a good spot. Um, and then there's you. You can just wait here. Oh, there's a dude. Ow. Get fire blasted. this. Can't reach him with anyone besides her. How do you fare? That 15 damage hurts. Okay, let's just not. could javelin him and then back up. Let's do that. Quack. There we go. all the way back here on his own. Alright, these three. Let's see. Can you kill this guy? Yep. Okay. Get rid of him. Hey! Bam. Nailed it. Okay. There's a restory thing, but this is Probably not safe to just go stand on. That feels like a bait. So the boss is right freaking here. I might not even want to move up anymore. So I don't want to aggro him. And how long does this light last? It looks like it shrunk. It probably just shrinks each turn like everything else. Uh, Stand in front of her. Oh, you went down to attack him. Okay. I still get steel lance equip. Oh, it's another dude. I'm still quite capable. Iron lance. You get the sixty-three. Nice. Was that sufficient? Level up. Ooh, strength, dex, resistance, luck. Attack this guy. Just 
Slim Lantern. Bam. Get that break. And I can see here. Anyone down here in this corner? No? enough damage. Can, you can reach. You can also reach the longbow. Go ahead and blast him. We'll get Alfred this kill. And Lance. You right. Level up. Strength, tech, speed, defense, resistance. Very good level up. Okay, just move up a little bit there. Oh, hello. Just these three to move. Just gonna move up <laughs> ever so slowly. Nope. Yeah, I got the boss. A little late to be saving the day. We killed off the villagers ages ago. <laughs> well, that's rude. Ow. Why you gotta hit me? Ouch. There's this one mage over there. Okay. Fire blast this dude. Bam. Bam. Iron Axe. I hope you find peace. That killed the Futuron. Up. Okay, you can move up here. Up here. Let's see. You can engage and zoom on up over here. Is. It would be an archer there. That's awkward. Hmm. Okay, heal up a leer. Go ahead and do this. Break. 
all these extra attacks. I could fireball him, but he'll probably just attack her, which is a problem. So, probably need to just have her back off. Dodge that one. Good. It's the archer. Okay, he doesn't kill her, thank gosh. It's mage. Ow. Okay. Get to move up. You come over here. Heal Chloe. She could go up there and kill that mage if I can have other people kill this guy. I can go around. Okay, and one saw only 38 hit chance. Oh, we got it. Okay. I lucked out with that one. Okay. Get rid of him. Level up. Just not all the defense stats. Neither does Rider's Bane, so just Slim Lansom, I guess. Oh. Die. If this love is a crime. Okay, get rid of that guy. Back up out of his range. He could kill her. Just the problem here. I think the safest thing for me to do is just have her back up. You can just move up. That's a little risky. Heal. Okay, level up. It's a bunch of stats. Kaya Bond. Death Mastery plus one. Here goes. Okay. You can come into the bushes. Now he has no hit chance, so no possibility of him doing any damage from here. I cannot afford to lose. For her. Let's hit him with another poison. Ow. Okay. Long bowing. Give him a long bow shot where he can't fight back. Just trying to see if I can squeeze out any more XP anywhere. But from you, I'll only do 18 damage back. Go for it. Bam. Just chucking axes at each other. Yeah. 
Yep, that's safe. Let's do that. Need some help? I am. Ow. Okay. You need to stay there. Okay. So now I can kill him with either one of these two. Oh, she can't reach actually. Okay, well. Finish him off. Let me help. <laughs> Killed him with a chain attack. You think this is justice, huh? <laughs> Leo gets all the experience despite doing nothing. Ooh, get a talisman. Send that to the convoy. I didn't even use that torch. That's the last of the bandits. You've been a huge help, Yunaka. If not for you, we'd be scratching our heads in an empty shrine right about now. I can't Indeed. thank you enough. It was nothing, really. I wonder who took it from the shrine in the first place. I mean, what if it was just her? <laughs> she is a thief class, after all. It must have been those bandits, right? Uh, well... Yeah, she totally stole it. What's the matter? I have a... uh... confession. The thing is, I didn't find the ring. I stole it. Huh? Hey, at least she came clean. I was strapped for money, and when I saw the shrine, I figured it might have valuables. I went inside, heard Micaiah's voice, and... Pow! There's the ring, staring right at me. I was just looking to make a quick bundle of dough. I, I'm sorry. I see. When I learned that you two were royalty, I panicked and... Kinda... well... lied. Really, I'm no different from those bandits. I'll accept whatever punishment you give me. Well, all is forgiven, as long as you join me. Hold on. You were planning to sell the ring? Yeah. Well then, why didn't you? You could have run for the hills as soon as the Divine Dragon handed it to you. We're useless in the dark. Would have been easy to give us the slip. But instead, you stuck around and risked your neck for us. Why? Well, because of Micaiah. When she started talking to me, I got this feeling that I just couldn't shake. I felt like... like I had to help her get to the Divine Dragon. Yunaka has shown me nothing but kindness. Fighting by her side, I saw a bright path ahead. When I sensed Sombron's return, I called out in the dark. It was she who answered. I am to blame for entangling her in all this. Yunaka has done nothing wrong. I hear you, but she did lie to us. As Prince, I'm not supposed to let that go without some sort of punishment. Lay it on me. I can handle it. Your punishment is to remove the stars from your hair. How about joining our forces? Say, what now? That too. We're on a journey to collect the emblem rings and defeat the Fell Dragon. I know it's a lot to ask, but will you pledge yourself to our cause? What do you think, Alfred? A fitting punishment? <laughs> I love it! Our army is pretty lean, so adding a new recruit makes a lot of sense. And Yunaka clearly has raw talent. She could be a real asset. I won't let you down. Thank you. Both of you. Don't mention it. And Yunaka, allow me to be the first to say. Hiya, Papaya. <laughs> Hiya, Papaya. <laughs> well, my camera started having issues, so I just went ahead and turned that off. Uh, about to end this session anyway, so I'll just finish this with no avatar. Hiya, Papaya! Back at ya, Divine One! With that settled, let's hurry onward. We've got to cross into Brodia, right? Yes. Mother sent a letter to the Brodian King when we left the castle. He should be expecting us. Good. Okay. The Kingdom of Might. I'm curious to see what it's like there. I want the rings. Oh, it's Mystery Girl. 
Huh? Is that... Hey! You're the girl I met in Flora Milltown. Vale, wasn't it? Oh! What a coincidence finding you here! I'm glad to see you again. You left so abruptly last time, it really caught me off guard. Do you live around here? No, I'm just passing through. Well, looking for someone, really. Who are you looking, looking for? for me? A person I must talk to again no matter what. My sibling. You were separated Did I look like then. you? I'm sorry. It's painful to be apart from one's family. Do you have any idea where to look? None. I don't even know what face to look for. Oh, so We've been apart matter. since I was very young. But they did give me something long ago. This. What that looks ominous. Stone. It's my good luck charm. I know that as long as I have this, we'll be reunited someday. I'm sure you will. But don't forget to take care of yourself. Look, your leg's wounded. This kind of thing happens all the time. It looks pretty deep. There. That ought to hold for a while. Look at the chains, by the way. Thank you. You're quite kind to help a complete stranger like me. Since we're taking the time to bandage her leg, can we give her a pair of shoes? You're not a stranger. You saved my life, remember? This girl's wandering the world looking for a sibling they don't even know what they look like. She needs some shoes. That makes us friends as far as I'm concerned. And friends help each other. Friends? <laughs> Should I not have said that? No, no. I'm just so happy to have someone I can call a friend. It's like a dream. How cute. I can't recall the last time I was treated with such kindness. What do you mean by that? I'm sorry, but I have to go. Are you sure? Thank you for the bandage. Hope to see you again. There she goes. See you around, Vale. Woo! It's a legendary Somnio, huh? Guess it better be on my best behavior. Well, now we can support with her. <laughs> Impressive work out there today, Yunaka. Whoa, what? I got praise from the Divine One? Zappy! I'm thrilled! Beyond thrilled! I'm serious. Skills like yours are in high demand. You must have been a mercenary or something. Right, um, mercenary, yeah. You could tell? I mean, obviously I've <laughs> murked a time or two, no big deal. You've been out there murking people? I thought so. With strength like yours, you must be pretty well known, too. Uh, sure? I mean, yep. People, uh, people know me. She's infamous, isn't she? I'll bet some of our allies are well acquainted with your reputation already. <laughs> I'll have to ask around. There must be stories. That, no, I mean, uh, could I ask you to maybe not do that? What? Why? <sighs> because I lied. Again? I've never been a mercenary. You said it and it sounded nice, so I went with it. I'm sorry. I'm confused. You asked me about my past. I panicked. And just like always, I hid behind a lie. I'm truly sorry, Divine One. I should not have deceived you. I mean, it's pretty obvious, though. You were it's only trying good. to praise me and I just had to go and ruin it. I'll take my leave. Yunaka? Support. Graham and Chloe have a support. <sighs> this mission is taking so much longer than I thought. By the time I'm done, it'll be too late. What's the rush, Chloe? Oh, do you have a hot day tonight? Oh my no, gosh. There's this folk food stall I was hoping to visit. A folk food stall? Yeah, I have a thing for local foods made with unusual ingredients. But the shops that sold them were already rare, and the war has made them almost non-existent. I heard there was a food stall opening today, so I was hoping to check it out. If it's that important to you, I can go in your place. I'll be your personal shopper. You'd do that for me? Sure. 
I'm not so busy that I can't make a slight detour on the errands I was running anyway. Whoa, thanks. I think I'll take you up on that. So, what can I get for you? It's roasted snake meat between two buns. They call it a snake sandwich. A snake sandwich. Why would anyone... Folk food is always tied to local traditions. Eating it is like taking a bite of history. That's what makes it so great. Sure. Oh. Huh. I think that makes sense. From a certain point of view. Anyway, I'll be back in two shakes with your sandwich of snakes. Here's some money. Buy one for yourself, too, so we can eat them together. 